say hi to everybody. Say hi to the camera. Water. What's your name? Water. Your name's Waters? No, -uh, your name's Cameron. Everybody, this is my grandson Cameron. Water. And you're helping Grandpa fill the water, aren't you? Look at the dogs. They're getting water too. Oh, look, Bella got in to take a bath. Yeah. All done. Look at that horse drink. Look at that. Yeah. Wow. Crazy, huh? Are we filling the horsey water? Horsey water. Horsey water. All right. Moo. Moo. The cow says moo. Did you hear the kill? Well, Cameron's on the farm with us tonight. Yeah. This is our grandson, and we're so excited to have him here. I want to introduce you to some of the new horses that we have here on the farm. Did you guys know he got new horses? I bet it doesn't surprise him. It was right before we left to Oklahoma, yeah. so they he probably remember. Home. But I want to explain wh wh what they are exactly. I, d I don't know that I'd call them rescue horses because they're, they're in good shape and they were well taken care of, but the family couldn't afford to feed them anymore. And so I got them and I'm looking for homes for, for them. So I wanna explain to you what they are and introduce you to them. Hey, should we go show everybody the horses? Ball. The ball? How about horse, say horse. Ball. Say horse. Say horse. You silly goose. Hey, Cameron, can you say horse for grandma? Can you say horse? Horse. <laughs> of course you can't say Thanks. grandma. <laughs> All right, let's go introduce him to some horses, okay? Did you kick the ball? Here's one of the new ones. She's cute, but still really wild. Awesome. But I did get a halter on her. Hungry. They are hungry. Cameron says the horses are hungry. Hungry. Yep, they're hungry. Come here, Cameron. How are you, buddy? Hey. Pack it. Good job Dogs. today. It was fun watching you play. Thank you. So, she came untied when some of the other horses were fighting. This little girl is two years old. She's a sweet little horse. She's just learning how to lead, but she's gentle. She'd be a great prospect for somebody that wants to take a little horse and make it their own project. I mean, this would be a great summer project for a teenager that wants to maybe train their first horse. We haven't named her. She's got this cool diamond. Oh.
Now this one I am so excited about. I've just been calling her mama. I don't know if that name will stick, but I sure like it. She's pregnant and she's the mom to this Bay Roan yearling. So she should be having a baby in the next month or two. And I brought her home, saddled her up. She is gentle as can be. If Blake wasn't in his baseball pants, I'd probably just have him jump on her. She's that gentle. But Casey's here with a bunch of friends. They'll probably want to be on the YouTube channel. Say hi, everybody. <laughs> you guys want to ride a bucking horse? It would go really good on, on YouTube. <laughs> Blake, you want to jump on? Should I with these pants on? It's up to you. He's pretty bony. <laughs> He's looking at me like, Mom, will you wash my pants? He Look how dirty those pants are. And that's not even the worst of it this season. <laughs> yeah, this is bad. Now, Mama here is thin. She's kind of thin. She's 17 years old. And so I'm looking forward to get her, getting her healthy and and getting her ready to have a baby, but she is just super gentle. She not great? Yeah. Aww. Now that's one gentle, nice horse. So <laughs> we're gonna keep her around for a while, at least for the summer while she has her baby and we're super excited about her. Gee whiz, look at my pants already just on the front from sliding up. Ooh, you're washing those tonight, right? <laughs> Bad. <laughs> Let me see. <laughs> Watch, I bet my rear end's even worse. Look at I'm all that. Get up, we'll show them. Yeah. That's show them my crazy. hairy buns. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> So mama is just awesome. I love her, her baby here. We haven't named him yet either. Now that he's out in the sun, you can see him a little bit better. He is awesome. I'm gonna probably get him castrated and let him shed off and just start growing up and and because he'll be worth some more money. One like that I can make a lot more money on, which helps me be able to rescue other horses that need good homes. So anyway, super excited about him. So I'm uh, Lex and Lily are checking things out. And y'all know Pearl. Pearl here is getting better all the time. This is the one Moses came and worked with the other day. And guess what? I have found the perfect home for Pearl. But I'm not gonna tell you yet where, where Pearl will be going here soon. She's coming along. She has so much hair still, it's starting to shed out, but I may hurry and while these horses are tied up while I'm showing you, I may brush them a little bit and get some of the hair off. It's kind of a fun evening. Hey, come look at his pants. Tell me, do you guys think Blake should wash those pants or does mom get to? I don't think so, because I looked at her and she gave me the look of, oh yeah, sure, hop on. <laughs> Otherwise, I would have been like, yeah, never mind. <laughs> yeah, those are a little hairy, bud. Look at that. So, okay, here's a question for you. Do you guys have your kids wash their clothes? Because my kids, I've taught them how to wash their clothes, but most of the time I am still putting them at least in the washer and then they shuffle it and help from there but i don't make them wash their own clothes and here is my reason why because blake and casey help so much in so many other areas that i let them go outside and work horses and do the things we need to here then inside so tell me what do you guys do, do please you... say no because <laughs> i don't want to have a side day no, yeah me. should blake wash his own clothes casey should you wash your own clothes i know how to Kay casey's over here with her friends just having a good time with the dogs tonight so casey cleaned bathrooms for me today i would rather wash clothes than clean bathrooms so 
I'd rather ride horses than clean clothes. <laughs> well, thanks for jumping on mama here. Yep. Just so people see how gentle and nice she is. So I'm gonna go grab a brush real quick and brush some of these off and then it's time to do chores before the sun just is going down. And uh, it's time to wrap it up for the day. Thanks for coming along. It's fun having my grandson in town. Did you introduce all the horses? All the Did new ones. Maybe? So, well, I guess I had to recap real quick. So there's this little filly. I probably didn't say much about her. She's, like I say, probably six months old. She's um, just starting to get halter broke. There's that stick in front of her I need to move. She's, she's just a cutie and uh, she'd be a fun project for someone if someone's looking for, for a baby to raise. Then you got this one here that I showed you that's two years old, has the diamond on its forehead and um oh girl and she's ready to start riding this summer if someone wanted to do that this other little baby also has like a diamond not quite as uniform but has a little star or whatever on its head we got these cute little goats here some of them are trying to get Drink. And then these two woolly ones are little rams. That's why they look different. They're not goats. They're actually a, a type of sheep. If you're interested in this one and would like a project that's just a cute little baby, they are a little thin. Um, the people were taking the best care they could of them, but they admitted they couldn't afford to feed them anymore. And so we're going to be putting some weight on them. We've already been de deworming them. And like I say, this one would be a fun project. Pearl's going to somebody. Start guessing. Some of you may have an idea where she's going. All right, Pearl, are you showing that you still got a ways to go, don't you? And then this Bay Roan yearling of mamas i would i would let him go for a thousand dollars but i really would like to get him castrated and get him dewormed and just get him in better shape but he's going to be well worth that and then mama is not for sale she's staying here for a while gonna have a baby and gonna be a babysitter here on the farm for a while Yo.